Madam President, High Representative, Vice President, ladies and gentlemen, dear colleagues, we are all following the political developments in Georgia with great concern. The political situation in the country has rapidly deteriorated. Therefore, I support the efforts of all facilitators to relaunch and strengthen dialogue between the opposition and the government. Georgia is indeed facing numerous challenges such as the COVID-19 pandemic, economic development, social cohesion and security. Therefore, political leaders need to overcome this political crisis quickly and to find long-term solutions together. The way forward should include an ambitious electoral reform, a rule of law and court reform also addressing politicised justice, power sharing in Parliament, including the setup of the Investigative Commission, and potentially new elections, and also the preparation for the local elections plan for autumn this year. As the High Representative just mentioned, next week's EU Georgia Association Council in Brussels will hopefully state some progress that has been made in the dialogue. Ladies and gentlemen, dear colleagues, let me wish the newly appointed envoy, Christian Danielson, and also our EU ambassador in Tbilisi, Karl Hartzell, and their teams all the best to overcome the current political tensions in this great country. Thank you.